Welcome everybody. Today's coding challenge is to program a discount calculator in under 10 minutes and I'm going to use HTML and JavaScript. So the only thing I prepared is the bootstrap link because I can't yeah, style the whole thing in under 10 minutes. So let's start right off. Okay, 10 minutes. Um, we need some basic HTML structure and the bootstrap link. You can close it. So then we need a main part and we need to implement the script.js. So script. Js. Now let's create a div um, container fluid and here we need a bootstrap class called card and within the card there are two parts the card header and the card body. So now we need a title here. Let's say yeah discount calculator and in the body we need a paragraph and we need the price given by the user through an input which needs a number and we don't need that number the minimum value is zero and the steps are 0 0.01 Okay, and we need the ID is equals price. So let's copy and paste it. Now we need the discount and also discount. Okay. For the for the result, we need another two paragraphs, um, maybe with H four, and the ID is C discount. Calculate the discount, and need another one for the new price new price okay so we don't need the white spaces here okay then finally we need a button with the id button and yeah we need a class here class BTN, BTN outline primary. It's also a class from Bootstrap, and we need a class here. Um, I think it's form control. Let's check if it works so far okay yes um we need something in here um calculate new price okay five minutes left mm -hmm. i think we can go to javascript yes Maybe we can put a bit of margin here and um, let's say 
margin equals 8 pixels. Fine, yeah, that looks better for me. Now in the script we need the btn equals document get element by id um, id btn. Now we need an event listener. So he listen he listens to the button and on a click. And if the button is clicked, we need the values of the both of both inputs. So let price equals document get element by d price. And we don't want the actual HTML element but we want the value of it so we need to put the value behind here and let's just copy and paste it for both inputs and both output fields which we cannot see yet but in a minute um, not price but discount and here it's also discount then we need a C discount and C discount here and we need to put a new prices new price and new price and we don't need the values here but the actual HTML element so now let's do the calculation stuff C discount dot in a HTML equals let's say um, you save now we need to calculate the discount. It's price times discount divided by 100. And yeah, that should do it. Oops. Okay, then we need new price to be um new price need the calculation um uh, price minus this thing here okay Mm, that should work too. Okay, let's try it out. One minute left. Um, price equals 100 and discount 20%. Yeah, it works. Okay, so that was fast.